Hello, hello, and welcome back to Medieval Dynasty. Welcome back to the Medieval of all the dynasties. Indeed, we are currently building the old warehouse. We still need uh, four logs, so we're gonna find a good old maple tree out here. Uh, one that's not by itself, one that's kind of grouped up a little bit. Um, I like to, I don't wanna do a clear cut, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? It looks like there's a bunch back here, so let's just go ahead and grab one back here real quick. Um, so hopefully we have enough left on here. Uh, durability, that is. Anyway, timber. There it goes. There it goes. All right. So there we go. There we go. Let's go ahead and grab these four. That should be the rest of the inside. We are still pretty hot. Oh, we still have these little side pieces uh, that we need to hit as well. But that's okay. Oh, and these berries are ripe. Uh, let's go ahead and collect a couple of these real quick here. I should take some clothes off. Excuse me, we have, what was he talking about? Should we take our shoes off? Possibly, possibly. Did that do any difference to us? Well, it brought down our cold protection. <laughs> We're still just right at the tippy top, it's fine. I don't know if I should be walking around out here in my bare feet or not. I mean, likely in real life, I would, because that's the kind of guy I am. Uh, and I was that's how I was as a child. Anyway, let's go ahead and get this all put up. There we go. We need to get these two signs, which requires uh, two logs, two logs and a bunch of sticks. We have the sticks. I believe the uh, pine trees over here. Well, actually, I think they're spruce trees, but whatever. Uh, we're going to go ahead and chop the. Ah, oh, there goes our axe. Uh, let's go ahead and craft ourselves a new axe. Yep, right here. There we go, and let's chop her down. Let's chop. Unbearable. What are you talking about, bro? It's not even that bad. Look at your meter down there. You're barely freaking touching that thing. Anyway, timber. Oh, man. That almost slammed our freaking building. Anyway, let's grab the... I think we just said two. Uh, we'll get three out of this, but... There we go. Fantastic. And the hammer broke. A wonderful. The freaking hammer broke. Uh, we have everything we need. And check it out. We have the extra log that we need right there. Fantastic. Let's go ahead and get that puppy equipped. And we're going to be done with this. Now, like I said, I am a complete noob. So I don't know what the hell this building is used for, how it works, or anything like that. But, oops, damn it. I didn't want to pull that out either. Can I put that away, please? There we go. There we go. This building is now complete. Uh, let's put this away. And I don't know how this thing works. Now, we do have a chest here. Um, I'm not sure what the storage is meant for. These don't look like they're interactable. It almost seems like we could, like, add extra stuff in here or something. I'm not exactly sure. Um, but let's go ahead and take a look at our inventory, see if there's anything we can drop off. Um, but we're going to be making a little bit of money next. We need to start unlocking some of our stuff. Okay, and if we look here, our uh, foods are starting to uh, go bad, uh, right? Um, any of this stuff can we put in there? How much weight is this adding to our bodies, by the way? Um, I don't know if we could plant trees yet. Let's just go ahead and put this in here. There we go. Stones we're just going to keep because we're going to probably be using them. We only have 50 bucks on us or 50 silver probably. I'm not too sure how the currency works in this game. We have all these unripe berries we probably will sell. But yeah, if we look here, a lot of these are sitting at 65% and 50% as well. So I don't know how food storage. What does that mean? Does it work inside of here? No, it doesn't. No, it does not. Okay. Anyway, um... How was our overall weight? 27 pounds or kilos of 35 kilos. Okay. How's our food, by the way? We're about half hungry. Let's go ahead and eat one of these old ones here. Uh, this will give us 25 food and five water. We're going to go ahead and eat that down. And then let's grab... Well, we might as well eat one of these roasted meats. It's going to give us 14 food. It almost boosts us to the top. Okay. So what we want to do, though, is start doing some crafting. Let's get over here in the shade. I don't know if this is going to help or not, but anyway, if we take a look at our technology, for instance, um, we can unlock these, but these are going to take coins, right? Silver, 50 silver, 150 silver, 250 silver. Uh, this one here is 200 silver. I'd like to have this right away, along with probably the chest would be nice. A couple of these other things as well. 
the bow of course would be great as well as the stone arrow um we could get the stone arrow but that wouldn't make much sense at this point there's a wooden campfire uh rugs and stuff so as you can see there's a lot of stuff that we could want and or need and this is the stuff that we're going to be going for as well uh so like can i unlock this no we don't have enough technology so we're going to go ahead and do some crafting and go into town and sell our stuff so with this we need stones and sticks super easy crafting recipe and a great start to kind of get our skills up and uh, make a little bit of cash right and thank you to the guy who uh shouted out in the comments <sighs> about building knives and such. Anyway, let's go ahead and collect this stuff. Let's put that away. Uh, we need sticks and stones because they break our bones. Uh, but remember, words will never hurt us, right? Remember that saying? Whatever happened to that saying, by the way? I feel like uh, in today's age, that could be the furthest thing from the truth. I feel like everybody is so goddamn sensitive these days that uh sticks and stones may break your bones but words apparently hurt you even more right well anyway uh let's go ahead and pick these up how's our weight doing by the way okay we're just a little bit overweight let's see how many stones we picked up um here's another one now let's see if we can get it okay there's always a bunch of stones down here by the old creek bed just kidding it's not a creek it's a river okay there's another stone Okay, okay, let's see how many we can craft. Get in the shade, fool. Get in the shade. Okay, so we have... We could craft... Um, Oh, it takes two stones. We could craft six right now. So let's go ahead and do that. Oh, we could craft five. My bad, my bad. Now, of course, this does take quite some time. So I will be cutting through it. Just like that. Just like that. And check it out. We've earned enough technology points to unlock a uh, workshop. So let's go ahead and go ahead and check out workshops, which is right here. How much money do we got? We got 50 bucks. Um, does it tell us the recipe? It does. Check it out. It only costs five sticks to build this. You know what? I have no idea if this is a good thing to make. How, what does this require, by the way? Two sticks? Five sticks? I wish it told me how much these things run. Um, this one definitely weighs a lot more than the spoon. Uh, so I wonder which one is going to be better. Actually, that's a ladle. Uh, this is a spoon. Oh, look, it tells me the price down here. Oh, this is worth three bucks, a 50 cents. Oh, crap. What did I unlock? Ah, oh, damn it. I accidentally hit F, by the way. I did not mean to do that. I wanted this stupid spoon because they weigh the same, but it costs and they, the crafting recipe is the same. Uh, oh, well, well, I screwed that up. Anyway, uh, where do we make that at, by the way? Oh, crap. I probably have to make it like at a crafting bench. Hold on. Workbench in the workshop. Purely aesthetic purposes. Ah, oh, man. Well, where the bloody... Where the hell's the workshop at? Hold on. Oh, which is right here. And... Oh, we could actually build the workshop, by the way. Oh, yeah, boys and girls. Let's go ahead and build this thing. Um, there's obstacles blocking the site. That's fine. Okay, okay. Well, cool. We'll probably slap this puppy... Okay, let's put this down and look for a spot first. Dry. Excuse me. Okay, let's go get a drink, actually. Uh, at our well over here. Yep, yep. Okay, well. There we go. We're nice and uh, full of a water. So the workshop, right? Uh, this is our little house, right? So let's just go ahead and throw the old workshop. I think we're just going to place it, like, right here. Yeah, this should be fine. Uh, let's see, what do we need to build this thing? Um, stones. Oh, well, that's easy enough. One, two. We need to get a bunch more, though. Uh, let's just go ahead and... I don't think I have a pickaxe yet. I do not. I do not. So we're going to go down by the river, collect these stones. Actually, before we do that, let's check our uh, knifing knife situation here. We don't have any sticks. We don't have any stones. Um, how many knives do we have? We have five. Uh, they're cost at about five bucks a piece. I don't know if we should sell these or build our thing first. Let's just go ahead and let's go ahead and build our thing first. I think we just need like eight more stones or something like that. Uh, so we're just going to go ahead and collect all those. I didn't realize that knife, by the way. Uh, it took five, five um, sticks. Anyway, uh, there we go. I think that's like four. Yep, there we go. Let's see. Let's see. Should be some more over here. It's getting late already. 
Um, I don't know how I feel about the uh, pacing in this game. I feel like it's extremely, extremely fast. Uh, I might want to, I don't know if I can adjust my settings mid game or not, but I kind of feel like three days per season uh, is kind of a ripoff, right? I mean, I guess it kind of makes sense though. Uh, in real life, you'd probably take you a whole season to get this stuff done. So I don't know, man. I don't know. It's almost like each day is a month, right? Yeah, that's pretty much it. Anyway, let's go and get this foundation built. And then I'm sure we're going to need to get some logs and stuff for the upper part. Uh, there we go. What do we need? Eight logs. Eight logs. Easy peasy. Uh, I think these requ these give us two trees each. Or two logs each, rather. Uh, so we're going to cut down a few of these. Okay, there we go. Timber. Timber. Let's actually go ahead and grab one of these maples as well. Catch our breath a little bit. There we go. Timber. Oh, that was a, that was a fast falling tree. Anyway, let's go ahead and grab this. Uh, one more. There we go. One, two, three, four. Yep. Pull out the old hammer. Two, three, four. Okay, we just need two more left. There we go. Got a bunch of sticks off that. Oh, there we go. Let's grab that. One, two, and then we just need two more. Two more. Um, let's cut down one of these ones. Yep. Timber. And this should be the last two that we need. Uh, we have quite a bit of sticks once again. So we might see if we could build any more knives. There we go. Okay, now we need to do the roof, uh, which is going to require logs and straw. Let's just go ahead and do the straw first. There we go. All right, and it looks like we're going to have enough enough straw to do this whole area, right? There we go. And we'll need just four more logs after this. And then we'll have this done, and we'll see if we can make baskets. Uh, I'm not sure how that system works. It's already getting a dark as hell. I kind of wish we were... Um, over by the old village. How many did that need? Four, did it say? Um, let's just go ahead and chop down one of these trees back here. This one here. And there she goes. There she goes. No, I'm curious. Oh, shit. Did I actually die? Oh, my God. I thought I died. I thought I died. That is pretty cool, though. Uh, glad to see that is a thing. I did not realize uh, this was like Valhalla and you could actually uh, get killed by your own freaking tree droppings. Tree droppings? No, choppings, fool. Choppings. Anyway, um, I don't know if we actually have a sleep bar. If we have to sleep, I think we could stay up all night if we really wanted to. I'm not entirely sure about all that. But anyway, let's go ahead and grab this. There's one, two, three, and four. Uh, workbench is complete. Oh, check it out. Check it out. It's actually right here. Oh, uh, dude. Yes, yes. Okay, let's take a look. Wicker and wooden. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Right here it is. We could actually craft a bunch of them. Um, it only takes two sticks, and we have a ton of sticks uh, to be exact. What is this, by the way? Vases and flowers? Oh. Uh -huh. Now, I am curious. I want to see if we put our sticks in here, if we can still actually craft... Uh, out of this thing you know what i mean let's let's find out let's find out we're just gonna put the whole lot in there like so and then we're gonna come back uh we don't have them okay well that's fine i mean it would be kind of cool if you could do that uh but it's not a deal breaker definitely not a deal breaker but we have 38 of these so we should be able to craft a good amount let's go and switch it over yeah we can get 18 of them and 18 and 18 we freaking crafted all 18 uh, pretty, pretty dark. Pretty dark. Exactly right. Okay. Well, we might as well go to bed. Um, I don't think there's a reason to stay up all night. I could gather more and just continue crafting, I guess, and kind of test out our theory about sleeping. But I don't know if it's quite necessary. So we're just going to go ahead and go to sleep. Good morning. Good morning. What do we have in here? We got Jack. Uh, do we have any food? to cook rather and let's take a look at all this so maybe each season all this stuff changes 
uh like it degrades but not so much each day uh not too sure not too sure anyway let's go and eat that piece of meat and we're gonna eat one more that'll put us up to 92. we're a little bit thirsty but nothing uh, too crazy it is raining outside let's just head into town actually uh sell off our uh things here and here's some good berries by the way um i don't know if we can make anything with these berries or if we should just eat them so let's take a look at them real quick uh, it gives us just a little bit of food and a tiny bit of water so you can eat a crap load of these uh, it'd probably make more sense to either sell them or possibly uh there might be jam making or something in the game or juice making or something down the road i'm not too sure anyway uh, let's go ahead and get some clothes on before we head into town uh, just to present ourselves a little bit better right let's throw some trousers on how's our dirtiness by the way we are getting we're pretty damn stinky it doesn't seem like rain cleans you off at all uh, same with the water so we need to get that uh, wash station built uh, as soon as we actually can anyway let's get into town let's see if we could find somebody to flirt with uh, we're not going to go see Somber or Nadar, uh, but we can talk to Alwyn when we get to town. Now, we should be coming up on our trap fairly soon, and there she is. Uh, let's go ahead and grab the old rabbit. Hey, buddy. Thank you for getting into my trap. And let's arm it. There we go. There we go. Looks like we have probably one more use on that trap, uh, but that's fine. A little foggy out today. A little windy. Uh, so we're going to get up here, sell our spoons our ladles rather and then uh, we need to find all win and hopefully find somebody to flirt with uh, as we do have that for a quest oh it's sounding a little uh, windy out there anyway you know what let's go ahead and collect some more sticks real quick uh, because we could actually craft some more ladles uh, <laughs> for them while we're just sitting there uh, this stuff does not take too long, and it's really cheap. Two freaking sticks. Anyway, we just started to get a little overcumbered here. Um, let's head up to the bar first. Let's see where she is. Uh, nobody's working. Where is she? Oh, that's Edwin. He does sell stuff. Uh, there's Dobrana. Let's see who wants to buy it. Probably her. How's life treating you, my uh, it's, treating, it's treating me well. It's treating me well. Let's go and sell her our knives. We got five of them. Uh, we're gonna get 12 bucks off of her for that one and then if we come over to here we can see our ladles we have 19 of them she only buys them for 30 cents a piece not the best way to make money definitely definitely not the best way to make money how is life treating you it's okay let me go ahead and uh, craft up the rest of those uh oh i can't i forgot i need the damn crafting bench to do the the ladles anyway we could do these uh all guests are welcome we could do these knives let's just do these knives real quick uh sorry about that how is life treating you it's treating me just fine i have some ladles or no i'm sorry i have some uh stone knives to sell you five bucks yep stone knives are definitely uh worth it more than the what you got anyway uh, let's see if we could flirt with her did you forget that I'm happily married to the charming Hello site? Hello there. I know you are. I know you are. Anyway, uh, nobody's over here. This would be we'll the section. Food and water. This and is where. Firewood uh, oh, shut up. Shut up. That's where we would find. Um... Can we pick this up? Oh, it's just a tiny stone. Anyway, let's come down by the riverbed down here. Let's go ahead and just grab a bunch of stones. We're going to try to sell uh, more knives just to see if we can get uh, enough money to unlock some more stuff. Yeah, yeah. I should have gotten that other thing. Whatever it was, I forget. Anyway, we're getting pretty overcumbered here. Encumbered, overcumbered? I think it's just encumbered. Anyway, it doesn't really matter, does it? Maybe, maybe. You're right. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, we're getting quite a bit here. Let's go ahead and start crafting up these knives. We can do four. Okay, I need about one more stone <clears throat> and then a crap load of sticks. So we're going to grab uh, quite a few sticks real quick and just get the rest of these knives done. Yeah, I think we need like 20 sticks or something. Okay, let's go ahead and grab the rest of these. 
Oh, I don't think I have enough. It wasn't quite enough. I actually needed 25 sticks. Uh, so we're going to see if we can find five more sticks real quick here. That's only three. There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay. That gave us quite a bit more uh, knives. Let's see how much money we can make from that. Jump. There we go. There we go. Uh, where's she at? There she is. Hey, Deborah. Hello. I got some knives for you, girl. Yep, nine of them, nine of them. It's going to give us a $22. Excellent, excellent. Oh, it's you again. Yep, it's me again. So we're up to 45 bucks. So a stone pickaxe. Um, he said, yep. One of you guys also said stone pickaxes are a good uh, way to make some cash. So uh, I don't see any uh, females down here to flirt with. Uh, so we're gonna come back out here. We have all these logs that we chopped down remember uh, on episode one I think it was uh, let's go ahead and go over to all those logs and we're gonna build ourselves some stone pickaxes over here Yeah, yeah, we just need to find r stones rocks uh, because it requires four stones per one log so Yeah, yeah, we have quite a few logs over here but we do not have uh, quite a few stones, so let's see if we can find a stone pit anywhere. Oh, look. Oh, what is this? Clay? It is clay. It is clay. Oh, good. Good. Okay, well, let's go ahead and gather some stones. Okay, if we had a pickaxe, I think we could get more. What is this? What is this? Oh, look. <clears throat> there's a shovel back here. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, and there's clay. Can we sell this clay? Possibly, possibly, but this would probably come in handy uh, if we can ever build a pottery barn, right? Oh god, uh, uh, that bird uh, scared me a little bit. Anyway, not having the best luck with the old rocks or the stones, right? No, not having luck whatsoever. I think we need to go back down to the old uh, riverbed. I could get four of them. Okay, there's one. We could at least build a pickaxe and then start getting more of them from those rocks. So let's see if we could just find two more stones. And then we're going to make a pickaxe for ourselves. There we go. One and where's the other one? Two. Okay, let's go and craft that thing. Oh, I don't have the log. We need to get back down there to the logs. Not a problem. Not a problem. But yeah, I'm assuming uh, clay must be for some kind of pottery at some point, which is pretty cool. Uh, let's grab that, build the old pick. There we go. How many logs do we got? Uh, quite a lot, actually. Uh, let's go ahead and break up some of these rocks down here. That right here. We're going to go ahead and reorganize our stuff real quick. Okay, we're going to do stone. Uh, we're going to do pickaxe, axe, hammer, then weapons. Anyway, let's go ahead and break this thing up. Okay, there it is. There we go. A little bit hard. We have to crouch to hit it, but it's fine. Okay, well, I'm thinking you cannot actually break these rocks. Uh, maybe my pickaxe is too weak, uh, but this thing is not breaking. No, that thing is not breaking whatsoever. Maybe it's the wrong kind of stone. Um, it sucks. Anyway... Uh, we're going to try this again, but on this uh, rock. Well, I don't think rock harvesting is a thing. Well, that freaking sucks. All right, all right. Well, I'm having a little bit of trouble finding all the stones that we need. Uh, maybe if I... No, I don't have my senses for that. Um, yeah, yeah. I think we're just going to head down here by the old river and collect some stones down here, I think. We're going to have a little better luck. Yep, here we go. Okay, we're going to grab a bunch of stones. Uh, four per log, actually. So it's going to be quite a lot. Let me get these gathered up and then I'll be back. Well, here's one. Here's one. Yeah, because they're still not easy to find. I'm telling you right now. Tell okay, here's a bunch. Here's a bunch. Yep. One, two. Okay, we're up to... Uh, we can build two pickaxes as of right now 
we're almost up to about three of them we're getting pretty over or encumbered rather i think we just need one more and that should be enough to get us three oops i picked up a, a okay there's uh, actually four more right here there we go there we go and there we go okay we don't need the head and bane okay there we go we're pretty pretty dang encumbered uh let's head over to those logs and um craft up our pickas pickas pickaxes pickaxes yes all right there we go i don't know how many uh logs i had by the way and i can't move anymore dang it dang it there we go we can at least get up here to get these other logs there we go one two three and we're gonna craft three and there we go there we go we don't have any more stones we don't have any more logs we are definitely still overweight um let's just get into town and sell all of these uh pickaxes and uh see how much money we actually get per pickaxe now wouldn't it be great if it was that easy to make money in real life i mean i guess i probably could go out there gather some sticks and make some hammers and axes and uh sell them in real life i'm sure somebody might buy them i don't know though and if they would i don't think i would get much out of them like a dollar or two bucks i don't know they'd be more of like a novelty item right but yeah wouldn't it be nice if we could just easily just go out there gather some resources and make something and sell it and make a living some of us can yeah you're right some of us can do that but uh city living it's a little bit hard unless you're going to be collecting like I don't even know. Anyway, let's get up here. Put our axe away. Um, is, there a, is that a female down there? I don't think so. Let's go ahead and see if Deborah. Oh, we have a rambler over here. Let's see if Deborah will actually buy these. I think. It's you again. I think they buy anything. I don't know though. Okay, so she buys these for three bucks. Okay, three bucks a piece. Yeah. So, thank you very much simple bags are worth quite a bit uh this bronze shovel holy crap i might as well just sell this thing for 170 it's not like i'm gonna be using it and i could just get another one yeah we're just gonna sell that thing thank you very much at least we're up to 230 coin now uh hello let's there. hello oh check it out merchant locations many kind of specialized uh merchants scattered throughout the valley uh, do not hesitate to ask your neighbor for help they can direct you to the desired vendor or animal breeder remember that you can turn off tutorials yeah, I'm wondering, now you would think, like, certain people would pay better for certain things. Like, she would pay more for, like, foods and ales and stuff. You'd think she'd pay less for, like, pickaxes, but, like, the farmer would pay more for the pickaxes. But I don't know if that's actually how that works. So, anyway, let's come over here. We don't have any skill points, but we do have quite a bit of money for uh, the technology tree here. So, I'm not too sure. We have 200 and something dollars. I don't know what I should be building right off of the bat. I mean, I would ideally want to make something that we could um, sell, like the so stone spear here. So this might be a good idea to grab. It's one log, one stone. Oh no, a linen, a linen thread. Eww. I don't even know how to make those. So yeah, linen thread. Okay, okay. Now we could come back over here. So these are sell for three bucks, um, seven under a dollar seventy cents, seventy cents, uh, one buck, six bucks. Oh, the buckets actually sell for quite a bit, but they use planks. We don't have a way to make planks yet. This is just sticks, and it sells for three. This is two sticks and sells for one. For two extra sticks, we get so it's a little bit cheaper to do the wicker basket uh okay oh shit i did not want that plate i double clipped it clicked it by accident oh dang it well we're getting the wicker basket because that's the one that makes the most money um let's go out there and just collect a bunch of sticks and yeah i guess just um see what else we can make i kind of screwed the pooch on that i didn't mean to do that damn it I need to figure out how to make planks. I still don't know how. They might be at the workbench. But anyway, let's sell some wicker baskets real quick. Uh, oh, we can't. We're going to have to go home. We're heading home. Screw it. Was there any females over here that we could flirt with real quick? Uh, nope. Let's go see if we can find Alwyn as well. We're going to go ahead and pull out the old journal, though, so we could find him. There we go. 
He's just right up here. Uh, possibly out in the fields or something. What's up, bro? What you got over here? Some water? Can I drink out this? No? All right. All right. F fine, fine. Uh, that'd be like, looks like a cooker, a baker. Oh, a little duck farm. Okay, okay. This must be. Oh, yeah, here he is. Hey, Alwyn. What's new with you, bro? Hi. Nothing's new. I got my hands full today, not to mention my water skin is leaking. I swear it's like it's on purpose. Anyway, uh, well, that's too bad. Can't you just buy a new one? Uh, this is my favorite one. I'm attached to it. For you, my friend, I'll pretend that this is not disgusting at all. How can I help you? Well, to the west of here, there's a village that has a sewing hut. You can take it there and get it repaired. Yeah, of course, that doesn't seem like trouble. I'll be back with your stinky water skin once it's repaired, Alwyn. Well, he wants us to go somewhere to fix that. Uh, let's go ahead and check. We have it already uh, selected, and he wants us to come all the way up here to do the water skin. Well, I don't know if we're going to. Should we do it? How much time do we got uh, for that, by the way? 16 years. Okay. These are all on 18 years still. Okay, okay. We have no rush to get up there. Let's just head back to the house. I don't know if I want to run up there quite yet. Um, I want to do some more crafting uh, with the wicker baskets and such. Um, and I think we're just going to drop off a whole crap load of stuff that we have. Uh, because we, we are basically almost maxing out our weight. We're at 30 kilos of 35. So anyway, let's see if we caught another rabbit while we're down here. Nope, oh, there's a bird. I'm not going to bother. I was going to try to kill it, but it's fine. So can we punch birds? Possibly. You know, bird, bird, bird. Bird is the word, right? Yep. The bird is the word, indeed. Oh, yeah, blueberries. I forgot to sell them to old girl. Uh, we're definitely going to be selling these on the way back. Actually, damn it, I should have went and sold them. Anyway, um, let's go ahead and grab the old rabbit here. Do we have enough for a new trap? Uh, we need three sticks to do a new trap. Let's just go ahead and grab them real quick. Uh, set up a new trap. I feel like this is a good spot. Every time we come through here, uh, we usually have a new rabbit. So, oh, oh, it takes 10 sticks. I don't know why. I was reading it backwards, I think. Anyway, I think I just need one more. There we go. Yep, let's just set it right in here like so. And yep, there we go. There we go. Okay, let's get back uh, and drop off a lot of this weight and start doing some uh, wicker basketing. Yeah, yeah. Wicker basketing. I should have um, seen if anybody had any fertilizer up there as well because I could have started to farm. I assume farming is a good way to make money as well. Anyway, we're almost back home. Uh, let's see. Yep, we can see our little house back there. Uh, we're really, really thirsty. We're getting pretty hungry, so we're going to have to eat. And here we go. Let's go and get that water real quick. I need some water. I, I just got it. What are you talking about? I just freaking got it. Anyway, let's come up in here. Uh, we're going to drop off a lot, a lot of stuff. Like, I think a lot of our weight is coming from foods. Uh, so let's go ahead and just drop off all of this. We're going to drop off the wooden hoe until we start... Uh, farming. We're going to sell these berries. Oh, I should have sold both of those. Dang it. Let's drop off the mead. We're going to cook that meat, by the way. I think we're going to sell those. We'll drop off the rolls, the apples. Uh, are these food? They give us extra health. Uh, let's just put them into here for now. Thanks, John's wart. I think we could just sell this stuff too. 50 cents a piece. I mean, that's not too bad. Uh, that's just as much as some of the stuff that we make. Anyway, how much weight do we have now? 20. Anything else we could throw in here? Uh, we could throw this clay in here now. Uh, these feathers we'll just throw in here. Uh, this fur, I could have sold this up there as well. Um, we're just going to throw it in here. Uh, we only have three straws in this wooden bowl. I guess we could sell that. Anyway, how's our weight now? 16 pounds. Fantastic. Let's start collecting a lot, a lot of sticks. Uh, yep, we're just going to basically grab a lot of these little tiny uh, wannabe trees that are trying to grow in our yard here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These little babies, little baby trees. Uh, clean up the ground a little bit. There we go. 
Yep, looks like there's a bunch over here as well. Uh, that puts us at just a little over 20 sticks. I don't remember how many sticks the wicker basket takes, but yeah, let's get this all picked up. Make it look a little bit nicer around here anyway, too, when people come walking through. There we go. We got a bunch of sticks on this side as well. Uh, we'll just pick them, basically just pick them up until we start to get a little over encumbered. Over encumbered. I think it's just encumbered. <laughs> anyway, we can basically grab 20 kilos of uh, sticks, which is quite a lot. There we go. Oh, well, we unlocked a new survival skill. Excellent. Let's go ahead and uh, check out that real quick. Go under here. We come back to this. All right. Survival knowledge. Um, we're just going to go ahead and get the third level on the more experience. I think that makes the most sense. Yes. Okay. Fantastic. Let's just kind of keep gathering up sticks, uh, cleaning up our property as it was. Get these little guys. These will grow into full trees, I believe, at some point. Oh, that's nightshade. Check it out. Deadly nightshade. I don't know if that's something we can sell, but I'm thinking it is. I'm thinking it is. Anyway, uh, have we started getting overcumbered yet? No, we have not. Uh, we have a lot of stuff we could pick up here as well. There we go. Oops, easy. Is that more nightshade? It was. Uh, we'll see if we can sell that to Deborah. But we got a lot more sticks up here. Let's see where we're at as far as weight goes. Okay, we've only gathered 10 kilos so far. Um, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Let's just get the rest of this trash picked up as it is pretty, pretty messy out here. Doing some lawn maintenance as it was, right? Some lawn care. Lawn care. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't want that stick, uh, that rock, but that's okay. There's a lot of rocks actually in there. Uh, but it's only going to increase our weight, uh, so we don't really want them. But here's a bunch of sticks over here. There we go. How's everything looking? Uh, a lot of sticks still. Okay. Well, I guess that should be good. I Well, no, let's just keep on going. We're going to keep on collecting until, uh, yeah, until we start to get encumbered here. Yeah, a lot of sticks up here. Okay, okay. We just hit the little weight thing down there in the left. Uh, so we have uh, 35, just over 35 uh, kilos of weight on us. Let's go ahead and cook up these baskets real quick and uh, make us some uh, cashola. All right, so we're going to come here, go to Wicker, or whatever that station is, and here we go. We can make quite a lot, it looks like. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, right, and we're going to apparently make 34 of these things, so uh, let's get busy. This is going to take quite some time. Uh, it'll probably extend us into the night, uh, but it's fine. It's fine. We're just going to go ahead and uh, do it on up. All right, and there we go. That was 34 baskets. Uh, and they must weigh exactly the same amount as uh, the five sticks that it took to actually do that with. Anyway, we're going to uh, drop one stone, I believe. Uh, let's see. We're going to sell all this stuff. We're going to cook those meats, though, before we head back out to town. But yeah, let's just throw this over here. And that should put us just under weight. Fantastic. Yep. Uh, new production level, by the way. Uh, let's go check out what that is. Okay, crafting knowledge, sewing knowledge. Yes, I do need to do sewing, uh, but we need a sewing workstation to do that. Uh, but we could also do handyman now for insulating uh, walls for lower firewood consumption. Oh, yeah, yeah. L lower durability loss for the old hammers. Um, I think we're going to do crafting knowledge again, though, just so we can get that up to the 10% from the old five. Now, this does sound nice, though. Insulating walls for lower firewood consumption. I don't know how all that works quite yet. Oh, do we got more than uh, one point? Let's go ahead and put that in there. Okay, there we go. Anyway, is there a... F oh, we got a new building unlocked. The kitchen, by the way. The kitchen. So, do we need to, like, in the winter time, uh, light this thing or something? Or is there going to be different fires that we need to light? I'm not too sure. Anyway, we do have those couple pieces of meat. Uh, let's go ahead and get them cooked up. Just kidding. Soup storages and storages, porridges, and others. Oh, we can't actually cook on here. Bloody hell. But we can cook on here. That's right. That's right. Uh, we're just going to uh, cook both these pieces of meat real quick. 
We're pretty hungry, by the way. Uh, pretty thirsty as well. So we're going to definitely take a look inside our chest, and we are going to eat the most worn out food, which is going to be on this side. Uh, apple, might as well eat one. Can we eat it? No, we have to transfer it first. Uh, let's go ahead and transfer a flatbread. That'll give us 22. This one here gives us 80. Good God, an oat roll. Uh, let's do the flatbed bread, I think. Let's go ahead and munch those up. We're going to get that apple, and then we're going to eat this flatbread. That puts us up to 57. Let's go ahead and eat a... Let's put this roasted meat inside the chest. And this is already at 75%. Uh, let's eat... Uh, let's eat a salted meat. There we go. There we go. We're almost up to 100. Let's get into town. Uh, we're going to see if we can sell these good old uh, wicker baskets. And then we're also going to hope that there are some uh, chicas down at the old campfire uh, so we can hit the, hit on them a little bit and uh, see if we can get a girlfriend, right? And bring her back to the old pad, right? We'll see. We will see. I have never done that before, so that'll be exciting to experience that whole thing because I'm pretty positive we can uh, get a wife and have kids and all of that stuff. I think that's the whole point is... Uh, your dynasty, right? That's going to be like which the mark that you leave with your family. I am curious though, uh, is there one the do we continuously age? Uh, that is one question. I'm assuming yes. Two, when we do die, do we get to take over one of our children? And if there's a yes to that, then that's pretty awesome. Now, my goal though is to really just kind of get, um, I want to kind of, you know, learn the game with this mode uh but i really want to play the oxbow mode because that's kind of where i feel it'll be a little bit better i, I kind of like playing my own story rather than somebody else's you know what i mean anyway let's get over here we're almost to town it's getting out late as can be uh hopefully there's some chicas at the old campfire down here we can get our flirt on and uh hopefully take one home we'll see i might need to get a little drunk first uh, and other than that, there's not. There's not. Of course not. Why would there be? Anyway, Deborah, where are you at? Deborah? Deborah? Where, where is she? No, don't go to bed. Oh no. Is this her? It's Amelia. Let's romance you. She's married. She's married. Is that Deborah? I think that's her walking away. I don't think she's going to help us. It's too late. Oh, she does. She does. Oh, good. Oh, good. I'm glad you got it. Let's go ahead and sell those wicker. Uh, first, we're going to sell this bowl because we don't need it. And then we're going to sell all of these. So we get a dollar fifty, which is half the price of what they were uh, worth on that other menu. But anyway, let's go ahead and sell them. We're going to sell all of them. We're going to get 50 bucks for those. Uh, not too bad. Not too bad as 50 bucks for not that much work. Not really that much work at all. Uh, I would like to find some manure. I'm OK. I'm OK. Uh, you know, that one guy back here has a mission. I think we're going to... Oh, wait, is this a... Uh, oh, that's what's his name. Yeah, I wanted to kind of find some manure, which I'm thinking the farmer guy. Or maybe it's this person here. Hello. Let me see if he sells any... Uh, My worries never disappoint. Let's see if he sells any fertilizer. He has the bag. We don't need that. We have a simple bag. Oh, he has a straw hat. That should help with heat. Oh, they're kind of expensive, but... Oh, he does sell some fertilizer. How much is it? I don't know how many we need. Uh, type of material. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's go ahead and buy. It'd be 130 bucks for 29. Let's just buy 10, I suppose, for 45 bucks. We'll see how that works. That leaves us have with nice $86. Hola. Hello, traveler. How are you? You're hey, married too? Is everybody married in this damn village? Anyway, let's get back here. Okay, I'm a little bit sad. Uh, let's talk to this guy and see what his mission uh, quest is for, right? Okay, I can't talk to him sitting down. Hey, what's up, Nij? Nijio? Uh, Nigowaj? Nigowa? Hello there. Hey, Nigowa. How can I help you? I could use your help. I want to renovate my house, but I don't have a building hammer on me. Could you bring me one? Uh, yeah, sure thing, bro. Hey, old friend. Okay, he, want, nice he wants a brand new hammer, by the way. Oh, God, he d he's leaving me already. Uh, do we have enough stuff? We don't. We need a log 
and a bloody sticks okay well anyway he's leaving it's getting dark there's nobody over here um can we burn ourselves by the way no it doesn't look like that's a thing all right whatever let's get back home uh wait for the next day uh we will build him a new hammer uh but we're gonna go ahead and get back home see what else we can build in the morning oh no well let's yeah let's just get back home hold on all right passing through here there was no more rabbits that were caught now we're going to pull out our torch, by the way, and continue just heading back to the house. All right, and I forgot to sell her all the rest of that crap, by the way. Anyway, we made it back home. Let's go to bed. Oh, good morning. Good morning. Okay, okay. Well, that's going to be it for this one. We didn't get a lot done today, but we're figuring things out and kind of figuring out how things work. But that's going to be it for this one, you guys. So thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. And of course, we're going to see you all in the next one. Later on, everybody. Later, later on.